Bo. Finger guns. guns. Guns and fingers. Oh, finger guns in your bum hole. Can't fucking finger guns in your bum hole. What it does, what is poppin', what is crack a yo, my name hmm, is Late January C. Feezy. I don't know. Mm. That's all I got. Mm. Okay, yeah. okay. My name is uh, Monday Sunshine No Dog. Oh, okay. okay. I don't know why, uh, but it is. Pretty uh, sus. But it's okay. Uh, I'm Dan. <laughs> I'm, uh, uh, I'm Dan, aka GLPOAT. Wow. And welcome. What's that spell? Greatest living president of all time, and welcome to episode 151 of Bad Habits Podcast. We in the building. How you guys doing? Oh, yes, I'm man. all right. I'm yeah. all right. I'm all right. How are you, mate? Surviving. How's that? Good. Yeah. Surviving. Right. Know, kicking right. goals, mate. Kicking, kicking goals. goals. Remember that episode? Kicking I'm, goals. I'm still kicking. Goals. I always remember it. I always remember it. I'll that never was, forget that episode. It's a good highlight for sure, but yeah, I'm definitely yeah, yeah. still kicking goals. I'm consistently kicking goals. kicking goals. Nice. I love it. So I have a question for you, cunts. Yes, All right. Me. All right. I want you to tell me a celebrity. Now, it could be musician, you know, actor, fucking, any, like anything, like TV mm-hmm. host, anything that you hate irrationally. Like you don't even know why, but you fucking hate them. Maybe you do know why. But it's more okay. fun if it's irrational. If you just like don't like their face or something oh, like that. Shit. You know what I'm saying? You uh, see someone, you're like, man, fuck that guy. I have to think of that. I need to be presented with a few options. Ah, oh, let me think. Fuck. It yeah. might be just like, might be off the cuff. Let me, but go, someone. Okay. Uh, Will Smith. Oh, okay. Wow. I don't rate him. He's, he's, a, he's a pussy. I don't rate him. I don't rate him at all. I used to know. Do you know what it is though? I have this thing where when when I grow up rating someone really high or something. I have the same experience with uh, this anime, Dragon Ball Z. I don't know if you've heard of it. Everyone's heard of it. But, <laughs> never seen it, never heard of it. Never, yeah, yeah. But basically, it's the same thing. I, I grew up loving it, and now I'm this age, I'm like, I fucking hate it. I look back and I'm like, that's awful. And it's, just, it's the same with Will Smith. And I, 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 I really don't like him at all. <laughs> Was I mean, it because like, of the, the, the Oscars it, thing? It is, it is mainly that. It is mainly I think, that. Yeah, it didn't escalate in this whole situation. It's not even just that. It's the fact that I just can't respect you if you can't respect yourself. That's like, like I can't respect him, man. He's a weirdo. The guy's a weirdo. I can't. Yeah. I yeah. can't. I can't. I can't. That, that's probably my number Facts right there, buddy. one off the cuff. Okay. There's no one else that I can really think of that I'm just like, I hate that, like, you know. You know what I mean? You hate that. I totally feel you. Um, I found like a Reddit thread that's going in there in case we want to pull out some names, but no, did you need oh, one? Please. Uh, do me to buy you some um, time? Because I got one. I, 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 no, I, could, I could chuck in something, but it's still like, it's just like the most random one. I was, I was going to say Kathy Griffin because she's just like annoying comedy, degrade fucking shit. And she's, she okay. was always around at one point and then was like, oh, she fucking, was. What, are you, what are you doing? How did you do? How, who was your manager? Right. But I don't know who that, that is. But, but like, uh, that's the first thing that popped to mind, which is, Google I don't it. know. Maybe it's a long shot oh. for me. Maybe there's fucking five more cunts that I think are shitter, but. Or that annoy me, but let me let me if you throw me a couple. Okay. Um I'll, I'll give you the one that's come off the top of my head and then I'm gonna just go through some of this one. It was from three years ago on Reddit that just says which celebrity do you irrationally hate? So I found it. Um Dan Kathy Griffin is like just a comedian that like no said was just around for a while. Ginger chick, um I'm looking at images of her now. I don't recognize her. No, I've, ne- okay. I've never seen this lady okay. in my life. Cool. Amazing. That means you missed the era when she was ever- I feel like she's yeah. an actor too, wasn't she? She's pretty old. Yeah, she's, she's both. Yeah, she, I think she must be like fifty, sixty now or something. But she was primarily mm-hmm. a stand up. Um I detest Taylor Swift. And oh, I, that's a good one. Fuck, I didn't. I, I, didn't I, I went to actors for some reason as my default in my brain. That's probably that's why fair. I was having trouble. That's fair. Oh, I got other one too. Um, I got multiple now. I just said that out loud. So that one, and I'm saying it's irrational because I can't remember exactly why I hate her. There was a podcast that typically used to listen to called The Read. So it was these. Um, yeah, I, but, I know them. You know the read. Yeah. So mm-hmm. uh, Crystal and Kid Fury. So it was like LGBT black culture they always used to talk about like real housewives before i watched it with tiff so i never understood what the fuck they were talking about but they hated taylor swift and they put down like really good reasoning and i'm like yeah fuck her and i can't (laughs) remember what it was and back since yeah i haven't turned back since but also she i don't like her face she lied on kanye and kim filmed it so they got 
to proof that she actually lied about what happened with Famous. Uh, She just seems like a a scamming. Like, people, when they get to be a billionaire to be that big, they're very rarely a good person. And I feel like she's just manipulative and just liar and, like, always just, like, pulls the white girl whiny tear thing if she doesn't get her way or something happens. Like, it's always woe is me. It's never, like, you know, accountability. Stand on my bit. Stand on my business, exactly. So I don't fuck with her at all because of that. And another one that popped in, unless we want to do like keep going around. If you guys got extras, then we'll just do circles. It's more fun. Well, I can add to the Taylor Swift thing. I think it's Please. like I don't enjoy her overall because I've seen how her fans can act and some of her, some of her fans can act. And I'm like, oh, that's kind of ill. But also they're youngins and that's how youngins be. And mm. they've got phones in their pockets and they're all just fucking going off on things. But um I don't know. Make the stallion. That was my next one. Thank you. Fuck, mate. Um, Sorry. What was the particular reason for Megan Stallion? Yeah. Oh, okay. So first and foremost, she raps like an absolute piece of horse crap. Fair. Hence her name. Never. Oh, there you go. She's horse shit. She's yeah. She's horse shit. Um, Yeah, no, just like not particularly talented with the rapping um, and just like what's happening with the whole Tory stuff. So I'm just like, you're a stupid bitch, bro. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I don't like about her? Her round face. I don't like it. A round face. And also, yeah, don't... Not, not, not the best. Like whenever I see her, I'm like, oh, oh, she has Jessica Rabbit lips, but they're tiny ice lips with heaps of red on it and heaps of gloss. And right. like, you know, have you seen uh, Roger Rabbit? Of course. Dan? Oh, I don't think that's uh, yeah, it's a famous uh, cartoon with like real people in it and actual cartoon okay. animation. Oh, mm, mm, maybe it's phenomenal. Anyway, so um, she has lips that look like Jessica Rabbit's, as in they're like you know just tiny little fucking just. No, well, they're not tiny, but she's got the uh, she does the lip liner <laughs> thing around that's it. That's what it is. Maybe it's lip liner that looks and like I'm, that. Yeah, because I was gonna say yeah, like she's a black woman, and they typically don't have vibe. tiny lips, but. Um, trust me, this is not coming from someone who likes her. Also, I want to be very conscious. I don't want to be like just shitting on women. They're just the two people that came to mind as well. I have yeah. no issue with Megan Thee Stallion. I don't know why people hate her. I really, I don't get it. Like I, this whole, the whole Tory thing, no one knows if he done it or if he didn't do it. Mm-hmm. If he's in jail, likelihood is he probably done it. But like, other than that, I don't, I just don't really care. Like we could go seems, into it. I've seen videos. She seems cool. Like Good. she actually seems pretty cool. Like I, yeah. I don't see any issue with her. Maybe, Maybe she is. Obviously, cool. her yeah. music yeah, hangs out with me, mate. And her music isn't function. necessarily no. for me, but uh, I don't think she's an awful person because of that. Hence, why we, this is irrationally hate. I just feel like it's not none yeah, of this is yeah, particular. Yeah, we're picking apart bullshit to, to be stupid about. So true. true yeah, true, it's true. just like picking the smallest thing. But I also don't want to pick on saying, hey, we hate all these, like, women, because that's not the point. They're just the ones that came into dude, mind. Dude. Um, if Dan has oh, another one, logic. I'll think of a dude. Rapper Logic. Oh, yeah. What are fucking... that toss pot, bro? <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. That's no one likes the answer. worst rapper, dude. Oh, I couldn't even God. tell you how that is, annoying that is the <laughs> What are you talking about? I completely about? forgot. Oh, oh, my stop goodness. disrespecting the... fucking, wow. fucking good culture, dude. What was that Ice Cube song he done? Oh, he did a cover, It Was a Good Day. And then Ice Cube's son oh, got mad yeah, because there's a line about his mum in it. <laughs> yeah. You fucking that is, oh. Oh, he's, he's a top He's a top-tier duffer. Logic yeah. is one of the worst rappers. Like, I think... I mean, lyrically, he can do some things, and he has done some things, and he's, like, got some bars on... Some verses on some songs that are fucking, like, tight. He's got some shit. Can't mm. front. But he's not after that bad rapper, era fell but... off... No, yeah. Not, yeah, technically it's not a bad rapper, but he just rapped no, bad. Terrible, what do you, what do you, how do you classify it, Cephas? He helped me out here. You know what I'm trying to say, right? No, no, exactly what you're trying to say. It's like he's not... T- it's like one of those things, like you could even probably say that about Megan The Stallion. Like she's kind of got one flow, at least Logic does multiple flows, but it's like there's something about him that's like it's corny it, or try hard the, or the like... Cringe. The cringe factor super is Super cringe. Super and it's, there. once again, he's not bad. It's almost like... Would you say it's almost fair to be like kind of chance, like where uh, like he's not technically bad, but he's just making a lot of bad music, a lot of bad decisions, and you can't, like it's hard to like him. It's very hard to like. Yeah. Okay. That's you know that's what I mean. Good. That's a good equivalent. 
get it. I get it. I guess a good I comparison. Chance is yeah. probably another answer. Like I don't, but I don't. It's like I don't hate though. I don't hate him either. No. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm like, not mad at. I'm not. Got yeah, reasons but, but I don't really like, like him. It's a difference between irrationally hate and not really like. I'm trying to feel there's yeah, a bit yeah, more yeah. emotion in this. Yeah, 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 yeah I don't yeah. like logic a lot. You know what I mean? Like, I re- dislike him a little more than usual. Because it's like, if he I comes on, like, answer. fucking turn it off, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a few artists that I'm like, oh, shit, turn a that few? fuck down or off. I stand about you. A uh... few? <laughs> a few. If we get into this, that there's not so few. It's probably not... 90% of this era of music. There's so many, gone. Daniel. Continue. Yeah, no, we... Um, you notice uh, I haven't said future, Dan. If you want to, like, if you want to get all fucking snippy about things, hey, man's like that me means haven't you said like future about people. That you, you already like. confirmed to us last week that you love future when you put him number one in the rankings for rappers. Exactly. So it's okay. We're over case, that now. Get off my backside. Stop. Pause. We're done with that. We're yeah, done with that. Yeah, exactly. We're done with that. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so people here are saying. <laughs> Uh, there's a few different names. Hey, babe. Hey, bear. There's a few names that people are saying in this list on Reddit. They're saying uh, Ed Sheeran. Someone's mum hates Ed Sheeran. Um, His mum. <laughs> Someone's mum hates that. Too. Uh, he said right. he's uh, he, she thinks he would smell like, like, like shit. That was it. Wow. Which is racist. Maybe he smells like old leather jackets, maybe, because he likes playing guitar. Yeah, I feel like uh, Ed's a good bloke. Uh, people are saying... He... <sighs> I feel like he's just because he's like a you know super ginger in the tats and he doesn't dress particularly like sick or nothing. Maybe like... it's, maybe it's because his hair isn't brushed all the time. Could so be it's like it's pretty, wherever it lays, shags. play it where it lies, like golf. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like that. Cunts are saying Jimmy Fallon. Okay. Um, maybe he's one of those faces that cunts just want to punch. Yeah, I've, I've seen people say they really really hate Brian Griffin. Interesting. Because he's actually, if you like dig deep into his character, he's an awful person. <laughs> like he's like, actually just like dog a, a on terrible person. Yeah, 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 yeah the yeah, dog. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's the worst. The dog, dude. He's the best. He's, he's the an worst. awful he's person. He's like misogynistic fucking cunt, mate. That's why we think he's hilarious. But it's it's not even just that. No, no, it's not that. It's the, it's the way he always, it's the way he is around, like Lois, and the way he has been. <laughs> he's just a fiend. Around, he's a like, fiend. He's awful. People hate yeah. him. He's a dog cunt, some might say. He's a he dog is. cunt. He is, he is. Oh, wait, we've, got, wait, wait, we've, wait. we've got two clips in the clip already. What are we doing? <laughs> Bam. You know the vibes. Um, a couple other ones here. Jamie Oliver. Comes oh, here. my God. He's <laughs> awful. He's Why, terrible. Dan? He's terrible. Okay, for I one, don't hate him. He, he ruined school meals in England. Oh, he right. ruined it by... He made everything so healthy... That it tasted gross. Oh, you couldn't have that. salt and food. Like it was so bad. It was awful. Sorry. And it almost the did fact that Australian so then that was almost like so good. So 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 You're good. Basically but, half Australian so right now. Yeah. Basically three quarters. Um, and also also he oh, sorry. Also <laughs> I can't do it. I can't stop doing it. Anymore. Um, also <laughs> I don't know what I was gonna say. Sorry, Dan, we um, distracted you. He is a terrible healthy. chef. He's a terrible chef. Oh, no. I've seen people react to his cooking videos, oh. and they're like, what the fuck is he doing? Like, he's awful. He's a, ter- he's a terrible he's, cook. He just sucks dick. And his right. face is that's annoying. Crazy. His face is... Do you know what? That's that's a great yeah. irrational... Well, it's not even that irrational, but the face is annoying. It was a great way to finish that off. That's a good, good one. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. There's a couple others that might be worth bringing up. Steve Harvey. People say they think... What? Uh, He's not a good Love dude. Him. He's weird and fake. But after Cat Williams was saying that shit, I can see that. Yeah, fair enough. Wow. Um, wow. A lot of people talking shit. Like, is like a lot of responses because sometimes there's like no responses when people say shit, and then there's like a ton about that. Um, this is a bit lazy. Someone said Kylie Jenner. I'm like, ah, oh, it's yeah. easy to, when uh, people uh, shit on the Kardashians, oh, it's lazy, man. man. Okay, Child. I'm gonna be the opposite. I used to hate him as well, and I th- it was just lazy because I just thought what they represented was whack. But I started watching the show because Tiff, we put it on it's on Disney or whatever. Mm. It's, it's fascinating. Like, it's actually fascinating. And I'm not mad at them. You have to because I'm not. Because they're so rich, and you want to just see what's going on with rich cunts. Because I'm trying you to have be that rich, operate. right? So I want to see this. I, I like to see how they Thank move. And the wheel, there was a doco called. I think the make it the, they had nothing to do with like they actually refused to be in it the only person was was Caitlyn Jenner was the only one in it 
um, mm-hmm. given an interview, but they took clips from everything. They showed how like the whole thing, how Chris, who she was, she was nobody. Then she knew she wanted to be with rich people. She ended up meeting Robert Kardashian and wifed him up and, and then cheated on him. And then he got vexed. And that's when she met, she was like back to be fucked up. And then she met Bruce Jenner and then they, he was like, I'll take care of her. Then Robert Kardashian got sick and like talk about the whole thing. And then how they did all the business moves. Bruce Jenner was doing, um, talks like, he'd finished his athletic career stuff. exactly and then she was like well we're gonna ramp this up so she took the business got him everywhere they started doing infomercials and products and boom 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 so she's been a hustler then she had the kids and then the kids were um they just kind of grew up around it all then they had a early when they were pretty young they had a uh, a reality show probably must be more than 20 years ago maybe late 90s even when like kylie and them were like six type shit really oh. um and it was like her and Bruce as a man still, and then the, all the kids, and they um, were showing all of that, and how that led into blah blah. blah. That's when they uh, Paris the sex tape came out, and then they were like, all right, well, you know, maybe if we do a sex tape, we can get this out. And Chris was a part of the negotiations, and they're all like caught. See how much I could tell you about it all? It's fascinating. That, like, that is crazy. crazy. Wow. There's so much, I, I and like prefer you to tell me than me to actually to watch have it. to watch it. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, just the interactions, <laughs> and I'm like, okay, you could be mad at them, but I feel like it's a little like almost lazy. I'm like, I like capitalism, and they hacked the system. They yeah, I guess. didn't come. Well, she Christiana didn't come from wealth, but she finagled her way into it and she worked for finagled. all of those things it's a good word right Fina- finagled it's a, is a great it's a great so one. it's like i can't be finagled. mad at them for that and like you know if they're full of shit they're full of shit at times and stuff but i just i think they're just like people trying to make it as well and like i don't know they're a little more narcissistic and they did fuck up a lot of things with all of the mm-hmm. what is it fillers and botox and all that stuff unfortunately yeah. for but yeah, yeah, yeah. either way i just like uh, i don't know i'm not you got some some respect there yeah Chris, um, Chris especially is a G she is Chris a hustler she's is definitely a G, hustler. yeah I respect mm. her a lot yeah that's probably oh, also God. part of it because yeah. no whether you agree or not it's like do whatever it takes yeah and like yeah, exactly, exactly something about that is like gangster like to yeah. yeah. an extent to yeah. an extent because it can go too far and blah 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 that's when the lines get crossed or get close to the lines yeah so I'm just not mad really um, anyway, we could keep going good, forever. Good take, but good take on that one, mate. Thank it's you. A good take. So we should just, I'll just stop this here. That's enough. Anyway, who cares? Speaking um, of um, gangsters. Yes. Did you guys to... watch uh, the Griselda Blanco uh, docuseries on Netflix? No. No, no, no. Oh, no. my God. It is incredible. I'll watch it after this for sure. It's so good. She is probably the greatest woman to ever live. I don't care. Sophia? I don't care. Well, well Griselda. No, well, obviously, Sophia, but like well, the Gr- actual Griselda. gangster Griselda. Griselda, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Gangster. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Fucking gangster. I love her. She's amazing. Oh, yeah. Speaking like, of that, Benny, Benny dropped an album. I, mean, yeah, I listened to her album as well, but I listened Yeah, same. I'll I'll try try it after. Time. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Okay. Definitely going to check Defo that out. Watch. 100% Defo Watch. 100% Watch. Watch. Hundo P. Like it's sick. It's sick. Okay. Just, just, just like just trying to speak to Dan properly, you know. You're talking Gen Z right there. Uh, uh, uh yes, that's how yeah. I speak. Yeah, that's always nice. mm-hmm. yes. on guard. Yes, Twin. on guard. Um, Every, do we want to get into like how you? I don't know. Have I don't really have too much to update anyone on if anyone's got any news or anything before we move on to next the things. Thing that's really happened outside of Griselda is uh we were we're still a part of the prediction league if you haven't told everyone i don't think we told uh, people last uh, week do we so dan's brother in england started this like soccer prediction league thing with like what 30 cunts something like that probably probably more honestly probably i more. think yeah probably about that it may be so it's like a WhatsApp group, and basically, I mean, you can explain this better, but there's all of these different soccer games from everywhere, from like yeah, African, yeah. European, like all over South America, and you've got to like vote. So it's like you can pay to go in there if you want to like go in to earn money, but most people don't. <clears throat> then yeah. you can bet, well, it's not bet, whatever, you just pick, and there's like different options every single, sometimes it's like the actual score, sometimes it's different things. So you just got to go in. I know easily i've got to be the person who knows the least on this entire <laughs> there's n- no chance that people know less than me so like i'm just having fun and doing i've been getting a few of them like i don't know how long we've been doing this a week or two 
And um, oh, it's, been, it's been longer than a week or two. I think. A single really? one. I think like you know, he, I think I might edge you out on the shit as kind of in the whole roster, mate. But I, I'm what I'm trying to do though, because like strategic, <laughs> like is sometimes it'll be and there'll be like 16 people voted for this and then two guys <laughs> voted for that or whatever. So I'm like, at first I was going with the crowd, then I was like, you know what, uh, fuck it. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes I went for the ones that just had no one in it, and I'm like, maybe that means there's no chance, but. But roll the dice no never nothing to lose nice. so that's been pretty fun just seeing it it's actually we're just talking off air like it's pretty funny and everyone's like talking shit i don't know who any of these people are and they mm-hmm. always like ragging on this one for, with this one guy oh. everyone like yeah. <laughs> yeah my friend uh, achilles he just for some reason yeah. him, him and my friend aslan they just have this beef and they like to troll each other and every single time he fun, gets though. one Aslan can get one wrong as well, but then Achilles will also get it wrong, and then Achilles will be the one that gets rinsed because okay. <laughs> da- Darren Darren jumps on it as well. He jumps on the bandwagon. And he's like, <laughs> it's so funny, it's just, it's hilarious. I, I didn't think it would be this good. So I'm very it's definitely more that. entertaining than me and Notion thought because at first I was like, oh, I don't know, man. Like I don't yeah, know anything fucking, about like, this. Fuck, mm. I got nothing. I got nothing other than the English Premier League and then maybe like two teams in the other fucking leagues, and, and otherwise. Mm-hmm. I'm got no mm. idea i'm basically mm-hmm. cfc in this, in this situation here but that makes it more fun because there's zero yeah, stakes like, like hey there's like me hey. yeah and there's no like if you want and you can earn your way into the prize pool if you do good so yeah. like it's it's more fun if it get i think today i got the thing right and i was like yo let's what? go yeah you, yeah i got it right as well I just went to the one. I did notice that Dan had voted for it. I went for the one that was like less people. There was one that had most people, and there was one that had less. So mm-hmm. I was like, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just stabbing it. But it's fun. What was the point we were talking about? Oh yeah, there's one guy who gets everything right, and he's just dominating oh to the point it's I've, ridiculous. I've never seen anything like <clears> it. <throat> I, just, I just don't know how you can. Who is he? No, we don't know. You know how Darren has his Discord and like loads of random people have joined it, and because like, he was on, his, he was a Twitch. His stream. fans. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. So it's a Darren and, like, fan. It's a Darren fan. Crazy. And like, and like, yeah, I've just never seen me. My friends speak about it here. Me and my friend who's in it, like Canadian friends, speak about it. Me and my English friends, we speak about it like yeah. separately. And we're like, we've never mm-hmm. seen. And now it's you guys as well because you guys have also seen. Mm-hmm. We've never seen someone get so many predictions right. Like I've never seen this before, and I don't understand how he's doing it. Like I'm Do you really. Think is there shenanigans? It's, no, it's, it's, it's impossible it's impossible because you hmm. can't you can only submit one vote and you can only and the voting closes after the kickoff do you think so he you can't hacks it can he go in and hack it is there a way and then change it based nah on because the score? i've i've checked i've checked hmm. uh, after people have oh like screenshotted vote. once you've seen his name yeah oh, so the easiest way to win is see which one because it says that the username of the person you just who voted. Him. you just follow him interesting it's more fun him, not to. Now that's it. kind of ruined it because now I'll just follow this guy it means I can just fucking start cleaning up. But if we all just follow him, then aren't we all just going to start cleaning up? Well, then what happens? Again, there, there is an element of luck because everybody wins. It, it's impossible that uh, someone knows this much about football. Mm. So he might just go on a crazy losing streak. Like no one really knows. But right now, I've never seen someone on such a hot streak. This is Good for him. like unheard of kind of thing. I thought it was one of your. Because it's, it's like DJ underscore something. So I thought it was like you yeah. or Darren's like a little AKA or some shit. I, I've no, seen that no, name no. before. Before this. Before even the soccer league thing. Oh, yeah. Somewhere. I don't know where. Something to do with Darren, I think. Maybe maybe Dazza. it's you. Maybe Dazza. it's you undercover. I don't know. Yeah. Could be. You've got to keep the kids wondering. Yeah. Um, so soccer is a big part of our life now. Uh, surprise, surprise. Mm-hmm. You know, I get a jersey and then... All of a sudden, no, suck it up, mm-hmm. gang, gang. Um, up. Notion, do you have any milestones that you'd like to announce? Mm. Oh, buddy, do I ever? Um, man's like me. Uh, I think it's overnight. Notion MTB on YouTube hit one million channel views. Let's fucking wow. gang, 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 gang. Well oh, done, that's brother. Amazing. That's amazing. Super stoked. Thank you very much, man. So good. Uh, that's. Oh, fuck. yeah, yeah, nah, nah, sweet ass. I, I, yeah, dude. It's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. did you say it was a year to the day the channel started? 
So I think it was like January 11th or no, January 13th, I started the channel on. Or, the, okay. or that was the first day I posted something, which is where it actually mo uh, marks it by. I, I made the channel in December of the previous year. And then in 2022, December like 19th or some shit. And the first time I posted something was like post, January, January 13th. So it goes by January 13th that makes sense. or something, yeah, yeah. whatever it is. So yeah. Uh, almost like just slightly over 12 months, a couple of weeks over 12 months, uh, milli views yeah. and dude, <clears throat> I'm so pumped. I'm so grateful. I'm so, uh, determined and excited and encouraged. It's great. I'm so, yeah. Super Good. pumped. Good. Um, Love it. Stuff. There's a episode that just came out, which I, uh, worked very hard on. There's a four part series from one e right. It didn't on, uh, in September last year on, uh, an e-bike my first ride on a on a e-mountain bike and it was just crazy so yeah episode one came out like that and i got it's the second time in like you know three or four episodes where i got 500 views in 24 hours and 500 wow. views on a long form video is difficult to get for me at this particular well, stage that's good that's really good I'll, I'll usually get like you know three four five six seven thousand on a on a reel but mm. you know my average would be about two and a half or three or something like that but then to get 500 in 24 hours on this one is amazing and yeah. i think that things are starting to spike again like they did at the previous sort of like hump or whatever the fuck and mm. uh <clears throat> hurdle and uh <clears throat> just feel i'm just so pumped man I, I just yeah i've always had the same sort of energy and been pumped about it and always kept the discipline with the editing and stuff but this is like the first uh i don't know if is it, oh, i was pumped i was screamed i was like, like a pretty major milestone yeah, word up. Thanks, man. Like, major, yeah. like 9.30 this morning, I was just like screaming like, fuck yeah, dude. <clears throat> Made a cup of tea and just, you know, smoked a joint and had a nice time. And then uh, continued editing another episode, which is one of my favorite ones to date, which will be coming out in, in like, honestly, four months from now. But uh, just loving where the edit, the quality of the writing, the quality of the editing and the episode... Um, pacing and the entertainment value has gone up i've got people commenting say they love the camaraderie between the other boys and blokes that i'm riding with and just you know the banter in between sections and doing scary stuff and like getting raw reactions from other people and myself it's just like it's getting the community vibe um on the channel overall and people are commenting about it which makes me feel more validated that this is actually working and shit so uh <clears throat> yeah dude I'm, I'm stoked as fuck about that fuck yeah congrats wow. Nicole. love amazing. to see it amazing love to stuff. see that um yeah man that's amazing i don't really have much i was six fuck all last week again i've just been sick since christmas for the most part i uh, got better by friday ish did some cool pods on friday night for bos um and what else i was featured on a pod called wine and the podcast wine and wisdom five there's these five latina women in new york um nice. one of the ladies is like a grammy nominated singer like a, it's sort of i don't know what the wow. genre is it's like some uh, like it's in spanish i'm not sure the name of the genre but i looked her up afterwards they told me on air they were super cool that's, that's crazy it. No. I ain't done when's shit. that coming out fucking question hopefully like next week or something i think pretty soon they didn't actually i didn't ask okay, far away yeah usually there's it was nice it was only like a sort of shorter like 30 40 minutes or something like that i thought it'd be a bit longer but um they it was mostly about beer and they were very interested and fascinated and about how weird beer is and it's uh pretty pretty strange it's pretty strange That's cool but that is nice yeah. now what we're gonna do we're back we're back at it the tmf classic project reviews we put it off since we've been back just because not the whole squad hadn't listened to the project so just want to make sure everyone did it first so we called to do that yeah okay. yeah all right so we're gonna sure. go a bit of a uh, screen share there you go you slut um, so the last one we did was Notions on the Corner of Notion 9th mixtape uh, mm -hmm. from 2010. Now, from the same year, this is when we moved to Canada. Nine, wasn't it? Fuck, maybe it's you're like right. Ten. No, you might be right, dude. I'm pretty sure it was 09. You know why? The only reason I'm... Let me triple check. I'm going to check for you. And the reason I'm why... Gonna, I'm going to bet my life on 09. 09? No, don't bet your life on anything, please. You, you can actually kill me like right now if I'm wrong. No, I won't do that. Uh, August 20th, 2010. Oh, you have to kill me right now because I'm wrong. <laughs> That's why I said no. Oh, now, I, well, the okay. reason I said 2010 was I remember you having a project and me having two projects and we got them delivered oh, yeah, to the crib. 2009. Probably. 
but we we printed them up and took them with us. Like if it came out in August and we moved in September 2010, that's why we did this one. So that's right. this was a part of that. So um, this was the third and final um, edition of the Soul Movement mixtape series, uh, Volume 3. This one, we got Mick Boogie and Terry Urban to mix it, which was a big one for me. If people don't know, they're the guys who did, they've done everything. I mean, my favorite one from them was their little brother and their little catch, oh, yeah. their little um, signature sound was it says like commissioner, like commissioner, like really like high pitched. Oh, yeah. Fucking, it was so cool to hear that. Like if you know who they are and hear that on your, on your shit. Um, very, very cool. This one was i'm trying to think if this was a bit more of a a different vibe i really like this one too it's probably the strongest obviously you know the the newest one is usually the strongest Mm -hmm. um yeah as far as the the music my initial thoughts looking at this stuff i mean we had a bunch of i think the the beat selection was cool um ridiculous a few of these ones I did, did suit. I mean, like you know, the final chapter intro was that the um, oh, that was Maxwell. We used Maxwell for that. Um, see it through was the beat, was the track two was the beat from um, what's the Black, Black Milk? Milk um, <clears throat> long story short, so like I'm really like getting like some of my favorite beats in this. Can't get enough was Chaos's love star, love song, Save Myself was um, Cunning Linguist. Um, Cunning was, Linguist. was that song called? I fucking love that. What we did over oh, there, KKKY. Sure. Um, oh, yeah. uh, this one with Whisper, which was over Sirens from Little Brother, which was great. Inshallah, which Produced was over. Ill Mind. Yes, exactly. Like Goody Mob. Like, it's a really cool one. There's some, some original production and shit. Um, I just thought the guests were really cool. We had, um, yeah, the squad, okay. obviously. We had Notion, okay. of course. Um, we had Tommy from the squad. Whisper was another dude who'd Tommy been goes. on both of our yes. shit. Habs is a dude from the States who lives in, um, Melbourne. Uh, we had uh, Ari Award winning Styles Fuego, I think Grammy nominated, produced on this one as well. Um, Hugo One, a British dude, rapped on that song. Uh, this guy GNZ from Brazil rapping in Portuguese. Our f- homies, the understudies, Ooh. this was sick. Uh, we had the guys from um, Oakland. from Oakland, the homies of um, Motown 25. Uh, the Royce and Elzai track, and, which is know, a slapper. Like Even- Black Milk Beat again. Which one was? Motel 25, 25 with Black Milk? Of course it would be. That makes complete sense. Fucking what a sick hunt. Um, that was crazy. Uh, we even had Chromio. Like we did a song called Tonight. It's on with Theory. And that was like a Chromio song. So that's kind of weird. Um, Kanye, the final song there. But yeah, I, li- I like this one. I was super proud of it. I think it works really well. The raps are really great. Oh, The Last Hope with Notions is probably my favorite one. Oof. The uh, Drake song, The Last Hope with Andrina Mill. And that made me love her. And then we almost managed her. And then she featured on my album. So a nice little full circle moment like 10 years later but um yeah man uh let me know what you guys think of of this tape you know particularly in context of uh the others baby d um yeah you can you can uh can you can you put my camera on is that all right because uh, oh I see the shit podcast, just you i see your, <laughs> no it's just your podcast now Hold up. You just, it's because uh, it's supposed to be there that's why yay. thank you, you. kind of just you kind of just took us off the podcast. It's okay. I, I could have got my cock okay. out and no one would have known. Yeah, literally. Thank you for I telling me. I, I wasn't looking. Out. I'm looking at the... I'm, I've got it behind the screen. I'm looking at the actual screen, not what the screen sees. I apologize mm. and it won't happen again until it happens again. I'm severely upset with you, Nella. Everything's on the table. Okay. Mm-hmm. Then that's fair. And we'll mm-hmm. deal with that in therapy. And Dan, would you like to tell us about the... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> your thoughts uh, yeah no the album was sick it did sound it, it do you know what it reminded me of it reminded me of um an event album and it's kind of like this is the Ooh. final chapter kind of like the end game of this uh oh. series of music what made you, you know? feel that i like, guess it was more it, it's similar to how uh the the kendrick album made me feel when i first listened to it and it was like oh this feels like it's like the the, the, the final album kind of thing you mean the Mr. Um, Morales? Yeah, 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 that tune, that tune. It's kind of like, I guess, I'm trying to even think. Interesting. Was, it, it just gave me Endgame vibes. Hmm. And this is, hmm. I'm assuming from what you were saying in the songs, is the final uh, soul movement. Uh, yeah, because we had broken oh. up at this stage. Yes, um, yes. Because Becca was my ex-partner, so we had broken up, and it was not getting totally weird, but like the idea was to keep doing music together she moved to canada as well for she stayed like a year and a half or something um mm. didn't want the same thing so it worked out definitely for the best 
but I think that was part of why it sort of was that. And when we were recording it, like we did these mixtapes, like there was like 23 songs on here. We probably did at least 30, 35 songs. There's a bunch of songs that didn't last year. That was, that was a big pile of, yeah. So we chose the ones that fit the most. There's still actually a bunch of great ones that just, I don't know. We didn't do anything with them, but, um, they were, uh, yeah. So it was all intentionally curated from the songs that we had that kind of brought things to a close. Like a, there was maybe that's, that's what, we, yeah. If yeah, you're feeling yeah. that, that's how it felt. And, um, yeah, the, the Jack beats were cool. I like the, the last call. Mm-hmm. Um, and what was the, can you remind me what is the beat on track 22? Oh, is, um, Justin Timberlake. Um, That's what it is. Because uh, I was like, I know this. I was like, I really know this. What's it called? And I just don't remember what the song is yeah. actually called. Um, I'm having a com- uh, I'm having a complete blank. What the JT? It's the second. It's the end of the Timberland one. Um, yes. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, but uh, oh wow! What goes around comes around. That's the one. There we go. There we go. There um, we go. That's why I yeah. recognize it. So I had to like take, it was hard to get a bunch of these beats because I had to like really cut it up mm. um, to get and them. Yeah. Also, it sounded more modern than the other tapes. It definitely hmm. sounded like this was. Yeah, thanks. This I, wasn't I, early, early 2000s. This was kind of like correct. approaching the 2010 era of music. And it sounded like it fit within that era. And uh, yeah, overall, it was a good project though. I'm, I bangs with it. I bangs with Tommy Guns, man. He's so bogan. I love it. So, he's yeah. the best. Super good. So yeah, so yeah, it, was, it was good. It was good shit. Good shit. Dope. Great, great feedback on that one. Nosh, what do you think? Listening back. Oh man, just like hella memories of like lots of vocal stacks and big sessions. Um, I love That's these fair. songs. There's a few of them that make me cry, uh, in in a positive, fuck yeah way. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Um, and there's a couple. Like I love the story tracks on it, the lots of stories, voice of, lots of stories, lots, lots yeah. of stories, which is awesome, man. Because like that doesn't happen now, and this is a great revisit for that kind of stuff. Because um, there's a lot of context, even the even the songs that have the features, which have like short and sharp things, still contextualized, still very themed. Lots of like direction with the song with the feature artists as well. Everyone mm. aligning with the thing concept, and it's like. Um, I know it was, it was good to, to revisit it. Like, you know, the, the beats you chose from the, the industry beats, perfect, like f- absolutely bangers. And we found, I think the reason Dan, that everything was so good sonically this time in like mm. the next level of better from the previous is because we, we found higher quality. I think honestly, some of them were MP3s. We found mm. higher quality files of the beats that and, might have been what it is, you know, because and it made an, my mixing older better. tracks, and, older yeah. tracks do sound dated because of the lack of quality in and the some, file and itself. some of the older yeah. tracks we had just MP3s, and I'm mixing into these beats, and I and I can't, I didn't want the, the vocals to like outshine everything so yeah. badly that so it was there's only like so much you could do with the older files, you know. Mm. Exactly, so so, I feel like these these were by default better because the actual quality of the 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 two track beats that I was working with had a mm-hmm. higher quality anyway so i was mixing into those and that's how i started mixing anyway i didn't touch the beat they were all at zero and i would mix into it and then get finicky like that so that's how things that's how i learned how to like mix initially it was kind of weird but it worked but these files were better from the jump so everything was at a high level already and that's cool that you say that because when i was listening to it on these imac on the imac speaker that i have um I was like, oh, these sound way better than the fucking other ones. And then some other songs, some songs and others on this sound better than, and, and it's like when they sound good, they jump out in, in a very good way. So hmm. I know it was, it was a good journey. It's always a good journey for me to listen to these again. Cause I, I remember, you know, recording it. I remember mixing it a million times and uh, sending the fucking versions over and stuff. Like, so I've, I get lots of memories from all this shit from, hmm. from tracking to mixing to everything. Do you guys think you could tell, like, so this is like the end, I would say, there's one more project, which is the Soul Movement Originals that we're going to do next week, which is essentially from the three, there's been about five to six original productions on each of the um, the three Soul Movements. So we took all of those, and then we had three other songs that were original production that we put together to a 20-track album. Yeah, 20-track, mm. something like that. Yeah. And, um... 
the idea, then we release that compiling, and then we took away, obviously, when you listen to it on a mixtape, it's all blended in, it's got, like, drops over it, and all this, so they were the full versions with normal, like, played like an album, so... I at first didn't want to listen to that because I was like, I just heard it all, man. Like, because I listened to it, all of these earlier things pretty quick, but mm-hmm. listening to the soul movement of, I was like, oh, okay, it gave me a whole different vibe. So, either way, though, nice. This was the end of e- the first era of TMF, as far as like from Soul District in two thousand and four up to the twenty ten. So once we listened to the mix, the the album, but we've heard most of the songs anyway. Um, yeah. That is essentially the beginning of everything. That's sort of where it all was. I mean, do you, can, do you guys get, like, from listening to all of this stuff? I know we've done it over the last couple of months, but do you get a bit of an idea of sort of where everything came from and, like, the influences, the things? I mean, maybe no shit's a reminder, but, Dan, maybe it's like, oh, okay, I see what you have said in the past, what you guys have talked about, why you like the shit that you do, why you think the way you do or anything. Is, it, is there any sort of, like... Th- mm. common threads that you guys have maybe pulled from this shit like listening back off the common threads yeah, off the dome that's difficult but it's it's uh it's obvious it this it kind of just reaffirms your stance on hip hop and why you think this way right and i get i get that from this music but uh in terms of like common threads fucking hell that's difficult maybe there isn't I need to, I mean, there, there, there definitely is. I just need to think about it. Well, maybe it's to... more like the thing, like what you, what would, what the context of the, because once again, to remind everyone, we're doing this, we're reviewing all the old music with the intention of making new music. And I personally have lost a lot of interest in doing music and didn't want to do it. So one thing I think we're talking on a pod about it. One of you guys suggest, I, or I did, I can't remember. Somebody suggested to go and listen to the old stuff. Do you guys remember who did that? Because I know. We should double check the tape, but uh, it was Dan. Was, okay, but, no, I, no, I actually don't know who. That was, it was okay. Somewhere. Well, either way, that was the the point <laughs> of it. It doesn't matter who it was. The point was, it was like an exercise in like, all right, let's see where we've been, and how it all goes, and then Dan, who obviously had no context of that because you only came around in twenty twenty, really, um, mm. when we didn't really put that much music out. Then you were a part of the release and and the videos and stuff for say Relentless, which we'll get to, but mm. the uh this early stuff is just more it's interesting to sort of look back and just be like oh, okay we did because we were talking about with the new music we need to tell stories because everyone's saying the same shit i'm like we've been telling stories i've been on the conspiracy shit i've been on the truth stuff like it's exactly. like, the fucking, like i've been saying it forever yeah. like there's so many songs about this and we haven't even got to like this is after this other we haven't thing. even rapped about the fucking covid shit ever no, because we haven't put out new music since it all exactly. happened. Exactly. So wait till we get to that. Oh, we shit. have a touch Rip on by Toxic City, but we probably that's part of the stuff that me and you will talk about. Yeah, that shit. Yeah, there'll be there'll be songs about fuckery. Yeah. So I don't know. I noticed. I guess the answer to my own sort of question. I guess I know. Like the stories were the main thing that kind of was like, all right, we really did that, and I I forgot how many songs about like truth stuff there were like there's so many there's a lot of truth <clears throat> music, yes. oh, yeah lot. yeah and so i always <laughs> feel like we never got put in that basket probably thankfully that that's what yeah, we I always did because so. our other music talked I, I feel like as I've, i'm up to 20 i just listened to heart on my sleeves it's 2017 um mm. and so i'm a little bit ahead of this i'm trying to sort of slowly go through i'm trying not to race too far ahead so i'm not like too far by the time we get to it on the pod but um, it's interesting to see even this next part because a lot of those things continue, but it's sort of like this is the context for the newer music. I think it's actually valuable, and I think all of the shit we've just listened to over the past few months when we go to the – as we get going through this next era, like our Canadian era, because this is the end of the Australian era. Um, mm. Then it comes into the Canadian side, and that this all gives the context. Like, okay, so then now on the new shit, we're talking more about maybe the plans and dreams because we moved and things have kind of changed, but we're still like, hey, these cunts are controlling the world, shit's fucked, and but you know, relationships and blah blah blah. So it's mm. um, I don't know, I find it interesting. It's a it's a it's a pretty good process. And if there are any artists listening, we're all producers. Like, I don't know if you, if you've been around for a while, like go back, listen to all your shit, get some contact, you know. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So uh there we go, you fucking mad dogs. There you go. Nice. So nice. then Dan, do you want to do tier list or the quiz? Well, I've got a, a blind ranking here for you. 
then ready to go. Let me rank you up, buddy. I'm gonna rank the thank shit you. out of you. Oh, thank you, thank rank you, thank you, you, good son. No, she gonna take those notes again. I'm gonna fucking do it. Uh, 151. 151. You big fat prick. Sorry. Ding dong. Sorry, I'm not body shaming. Wow. Wow. Also, you're not fat. That's why I said it. I'm wow. so large, dude. Like, don't even fuck with me, fam. Okay, sorry. Okay. <laughs> All right. All, All right, right, Daniel. All right. Uh, let's let's rank start us. with rank me good. We'll do we'll do rappers. Okay. Yeah. That's straight up rappers first one. Okay. Are they mixed bag or is it uh, of the same ilk? Rappers they're in general, would you say? Relatively mixed. I wouldn't say they're like crazy, crazy different, but they're like relatively mixed. You wouldn't put them in the same. Like, yeah. is it like Kodak Black and Jay Z in the same type of thing? T- type um, of. Uh... I guess type, but not that Ooh. crazy. Gotcha. Okay. Not that crazy. Understood. Okay. All right, first one. Let's do. Let's do. Sean Price. Oh, should we just put three? What's the category? Sorry, is this rappers in general, or is this like the rappers? Just, just rappers. rappers. That's it. Just rappers. Sean rappers. Price is dope as shit. Yeah. So, so, do... so we do like two. Let's do two. Three. Two. Let's two. do two to to share respect to the legend. Rest in oh, peace. Done. Rest in peace. Okay. 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 Two, two, two. All right. All right. All right. Next one. Jermaine Cole. Hmm. Oh, okay. Hmm. Well, is there going to be someone better than J. Cole on this list? Should we just slap him at number one? That's a fairly safe fucking bet. You know what? We've never done this. We always save the number one spot, and then we end up with things we don't like. So maybe at the very least, if we put J. Cole, we'll both be satisfied with that, even if someone better. Yeah, it's going to satisfy the palate if we get get. Get yeah, fucked up here, but because Dan is a bit of a cunt, let's be. That's what I'm saying. Dan comes with them curveballs. No, I mean, like, yeah. No. When, when, I, when I mean son, what, what I mean son, when son. I mean cunt, when I say cunt, I mean it with love. You're calling me a son. Yeah, oh, I'm wow. calling you a son. A son of a cunt. Wow. Wow. <laughs> you are you son. disrespecting Terry? Wow. Wow. No, wow. I, no you are my son, and I'm a cunt. Oh. Ah, uh, that makes I like sense. That. That. I, like that. I, like that. I wouldn't disrespect Terry. Come on, now, who am I? Right, that's true. That's Terry true. will didn't... clap me, bro. Like oh, he's not even—he's not even fucking with the shit. Terry's shit's a shooter. Terry got he's shooters. Hey, he's oh, gonna get. He... You know what I mean? You know what I mean? He's crazy. Uh, he's crazy. Check Dark Lagers for the win, still. Oh yeah, time. for sure. Um, okay, next one. Nicki Minaj. Five. Oh, five. Hey, gang, that's gang. my brother. Hey, 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 you know. All right, all right, all right, all right. Don't, all right, don't right. even need to discuss it. No, no, no. Um, ASAP Rocky. Oh, he, I'd be cool with a trios. Lyricists to for a safe bet for because he's going to say something like dope. I really hope. Okay, you like, know as what? Far as rappers, can... as far as quality of rap, I mean, he's cool as fuck. Swaggy. You know what though? He got, he got some, got a but it's funny not bars. necessarily just bars. Obviously, it's like artists overall situation. Yeah. yeah. So I was going to say, like, oh, yeah. just because Dan said that there's a mix, like an equivalent, like there's going to be spectrum, and if there's only three and four left. If we put ASAP Rocky, the and there's only does. been... Right, and easy is cheeky. There's only been one so far that was an easy five for us, which means the next one probably is going to be a four. So you I would say... Yes. I say put Rocky in three just because right. there's only been one oh. rapper that... Look, to be fair, I don't like Nicki really, but like she's there's way worse rappers than Nicki Minaj. So Way worse. Um, that's why I'm thinking it'd be safer to put Rocky in three. Right, Some might done. say Trio's No Forest. Trio's no forest. Ah, uh, baby D. Oh, uh, honestly, you guys should clap for yourselves. Like oh, shit. this, what you've done is you're in my head. What okay, you've done, you're genuinely in my head. You've done the right thing. Yeah. So done, we you, solved you, mastermind. You, finally, yeah. you've, done, you've literally done it. You've literally done it. Like the next one's Twenty One Savage. Oh. Oh. That's what we would have done. Like, <laughs> that is what I think everyone <clears throat> like would have done. Like I that like is I'm robbed. Wow, would you have put twenty one below Nikki? No, I would have put twenty one four. Yeah, <laughs> bless you. And then um, Nikki five. Right, yeah, you, that three. Yeah, we did Sean the exact. Yeah, Jake and Cole. Yeah. This is exactly where it needs to be. We did wow. not make a single mistake. You did not make a single mistake. I'd like to thank my mom. Uh, wow. I'd like I to thank the academy. <laughs> Good minds, great minds. Um, um, today, is crazy. I actually wow. just watched uh, Fight Club recently. Hell yeah, greatest movie of all time. 
he says that anyway. Whatever. Get a dog up here. Go to. All right. Next well one, done, Daniel. Well Honestly, well done, well done. Thanks. Thanks. Okay. Man. Rap songs. Okay. Okay. Let's start off with. Ooh, let's do. Is it the same deal? Like a mix? No, not not big mix. Not big variety in this okay. one. Let's start. Let's start with uh, Kanye West flashing lights. Ooh. Ooh, I'm not a big fan. I'm not okay. a big fan. You're not a big fan. Oh, no, I really? don't love it. Don't love it. What? I, I could go. I could be comfortable with with three off the strength of it being Kanye and the chances that there's probably something. Better and worse than it's it. Slow and chill. It's not like a banger. If we're talking about like favorite songs, like it's not a banger. Like I wouldn't say it's. We're not ranking favorite songs. We're just ranking these songs and blind. Right. So there could it's be a worse. Good song. It's a good. No, song, it's not like, shit. It's just not my are we favorite. Hoping for more bangers, or we're hoping. Yeah, for I'm more hoping like... for more. I'm hoping for okay, the ones I. I'm cool with a three because it's unlikely there's more Kanye. So mm. three because it's not a bad song it's just not my favorite kind not of a bad song. song just agreed it's a popular okay. one like it went hard I'm people liked it. it was a single mm. yeah three mm. three okay all right okay, fine. Okay. flashing lights three yeah and locked in okay next one uh drake forever oh, that's a great one uh what's that song how's that go that's Man, with Eminem, mean nothing at all. Lil Wayne, oh, yeah. Kanye yeah. West Get a bit of bite of a chong. Gotta take a shit in your drawers. You're a bunch of chunks you have, man. That's my remix. That would probably be two eyes. Because it's not like camera is dead. Someone's camera died. She's back. Two? No, put it in. Put in. What did I say? What did we say? Two. Oh, what the fuck? Wrong way, dickhead. I'm over here. I'm over here, you prick. Yeah, let's put it in two. Two? Yeah. Yeah, okay. two hours. Two hours, no forest. Okay, 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 okay. <clears throat> okay, let's do, let's do. Let's do Drake, worst behavior. Oh. Worst. Oh, I would, you know what? Right. I'm going one skis. That's a slap. Oh, yeah. That's one of my favorite Drake songs of all time. Easy. That, that yeah, the best. I want to punch cunts in the good. face when that song comes on. I, I would, good. What, what's, the, what's the word? Mosh. I'll yeah. fucking jump in the pit and I will elbow a cunt in the fucking face of that song. Let's it's fucking so go. Let's fucking so, go. After this podcast, I'm going to fucking put it on like 11. Let's do it. My that's house. Good tune. First. Yep. All right. That's number one. All right. All right. Um, <laughs> you might not regret your number oh, one. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. So good. That's the joint. <laughs> um, okay, next one. Okay. Kanye West, Devil in the New Dress. You're oh, a F oh, word. Oh, okay. F word. Okay, okay, okay. Well, that okay. four, I guess, isn't it? Wow. You're an asshole. Man. I love you so Look, much. You, you guys are all so happy a second ago. You're gassed yeah. <laughs> with Drake's song Alice. What did I do to you? Because you I dropped a classic you. after some yeah, things that aren't as good as that. I think it changed. I, did, I didn't tell I you to do it, this, guys. Four it is. I, I couldn't know. let you win like the last time, you know. I had yeah. to make it a bit more difficult. Had to make time. it hard. Pause. Yeah, All, right. Been, okay. he is it, All right. And what's coming in fifth? Fifth, uh, you have chosen Drake Pound Cake. Damn, another oh, great one. It's also pretty good. That was That's a pretty good, good list. I probably right? would have put only Flashing Lights last. What did we put second? Forever. Second, you had Forever. Forever would have been second last. Oh. Devil in a New Dress. Yeah. Probably would have been number one, worst behavior two, and then whatever was left was three. Mm-hmm. Um, pound cake three. Pound cake. Hey, that's how it lies. Pound cake is definitely not shit. No, pound cake's fucking I think, great. I think I would have done. <sighs> ooh, I would have probably done flashing lights five, pound cake four, forever mm. three, then mm. worst behavior two, definitely just one. That's what I would have done. Okay. Personally. We're, not, we're not too dissimilar. Not too dissimilar. Okay, okay, okay. Interesting. Nice one. But you, you tricked us. After you have, we got it you have chosen. You have chosen. Devil in a new dress as number four, which is interesting. Correct. Which That's cool. not. Yeah. Hey, well, hey, 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 by Very default, don't don't be don't be so. Very it was the highest available place at the time. It was presented exactly. to us. That's cool. That's, That's interesting. interesting. Eloquent. I like the way your brains work. Okay. Thank okay. You. This one is American Cities by Food. Oh. That's fun. What if we haven't gone there, yeah. you pussy? Oh. All right. Well, we ready? can guess. Yeah, I'm All ready. right. 
<laughs> I think I think you'll be. Oh, you may have it. probably. Yeah, no, I think you've no. been all of there. I think you've been all of these places. I would be surprised you if you haven't been to all of them. A little like tricky in it. So you've you've definitely been to all these places. Okay, right, cool. let's start off with New York. Should we do because it's so variety of like varied? Should we do like two? I was going yeah, get... to New York's pretty tight. Like, you know. Yeah. Okay, we could do three. We could do three and uh, roll the dice. New York has pretty fucking good food across the board. The best restaurant in the world, like Eleven. Um, what's it called? Madison Park or whatever. What's it called? Uh, we should put it in two then. Never heard of this. Oh, okay. It's like I've seen it in a few docos recently. Um. <sighs> I mean, yeah, fuck. Like, like, right, was, was... Pretty tight. I remember it being like sweet, but not like didn't do any fine dining there. We just got like you know that two dollar pizza and fuck or dollar pizza and fucking had a bunch of. Yeah, we were poor when the last time you went though. Yeah. Like Tiff and I have been like every year almost, and we weren't, but we weren't doing fine dining either. We were eating at better places back when we were like didn't have money, but yeah, put it in three just in case because all right. All right. All right. All right. Very interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Yeah, I bet you guess with that. Very interesting. Hey, back. You made us a shit second round. Mm. Interesting. I didn't tell you what to pick. Okay. Um. Next one. Los Angeles. LA is a little one dimensional. This is the thing with that because LA and California they have incredible cool. Mexican and they got some other. I'd say put it in four. Ooh, um. Yeah, they don't have many Shake Shacks, and they got all in and out, which is so desperately mid. And mm. the biggest complaint, say, like, even though LA, my friend's in San Diego, and he's from Toronto, and he's like, they don't have Jamaican food, they don't have anything else. So when he comes back really? here, they got nothing. He said it's oh, Mexican, and bad. it's like Mexican and burgers. That And LA <laughs> is, wow. whilst it is more, I had, like, sushi in LA, and that's great, and too, and everything, but, like, it's, yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised. Crazy. I'm surprised. Nothing. Oh wow. Okay. No. Yeah. This is from him. It's not from me really experiencing that. But he's lived there for like a decade, and yeah, that's what. Uh, that's what. So much saying. You know what I'm saying? All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right next one. Chicago. I knew this was coming yeah. up. I could say you put Chicago in. You could probably put it in second. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I went when I was kind of poor no too. Saying, no saying it matter, so I was. Oh, you haven't been. Let's just put it in you... second for now. Let's put it in second. Why is it good? Why is it second? Um, I remember just being a little more eclectic than like because it's such a northern city. I felt like it was. It was like they had a lot of different stuff, like a lot of different cultures and stuff, and they they got their own cuisine. Like New York does. I mean, New York has like New York pizza, whatever, that, and bagels and such. But Chicago has like their deep dish, like Chicago pizza, which is like their own mm. thing. And then they have that popcorn mix thing that's kind of famous. Oh, that's Garrett's. a good popcorn mix. That's Garrett's is pretty popcorn. fire with the caramel and cheese. It's lit caramel cheese. You don't know about the Chicago style popcorn? Zero. Yeah, it's like this place is at the airport. And do you do um, you live on Earth? Do you live <laughs> on you Earth? Know. I don't understand. You've never heard of it. Been around the world, now, nah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Haven't been to Detroit to be a cop man, just chilling. Wow. Just Even I know about it. I've never been to Chicago. I know about it. Yeah, yeah. Famous. So, I'll get there one day. I'll fucking, mm. you know. It's pretty close. It's like 10 hours. No, it's less than that. I'll go some man. Three hours. That's like six hours drive from Hamilton. Not bad. Six hours drive from the Hammer, Hammer, Hammer. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. All right. Next one. Mm. Houston. Never been, so it's going to have to be Fiverr. Mm, okay, okay, I've only okay, been to okay. Austin and Dallas. And, okay, uh, no, let, let's let's swap it for Austin. Let's swap, swap it for Austin. Austin. House Fuck. What do we have? What do I have available? One in five? Oh. One in five. So you kind of fucked yourself. <laughs> yeah, I fucked. <laughs> like, you've actually kind of fucked yourself. Austin, Austin was really good. Austin was really good. Um, but we had all barbecue for the most part. The second time I went, I think I had more barbecue stuff. Ah, you didn't come the second time. Um, back the first time, the thing was all the most of the time that Nosha you've traveled, it was like music stuff or whatever in the states. So like, we're all just getting quick things to go because we always had to be somewhere. When I went the second time, I like like the Bodega Brothers took me to like their favorite, like one of their friends owns a um a fucking southern Atlanta was should should have said Atlanta. Ah, uh, not our last time. Me and Tiff Atlanta needs a manager. Um, <laughs> Atlanta needs a manager. Atlanta's pretty. Old. What, what, 
what, um, what, what? I just say put put Austin because oh, it depends what you're gonna say next. That's the only reason. Is like if you say somewhere, I have a feeling what I know what you're gonna say next, and I'm just, I'm just gonna put Austin at five, but I don't believe he should be there. He probably should. One of the things. No, he swapped it from Houston to Austin because we'd been there. Oh, I see. Um, I yeah, put it at five, but I don't want it to be a five. I would put it at like probably two. Maybe three. Well, if you're putting mm. it at five, you're putting it at five. That's what you want it. That's it's not. Good. I don't have a choice, I Daniel. Know what you could, because yeah, um, awesome. yeah, that's fucking great. So then it really depends now on what you. Uh, well, what do can... you want number one to be? I thought you were gonna say Miami. <laughs> I don't know. Um, random. No. Oh, it's uh, cities in the states. No. It's, it's in the states. In the states. Okay, then. <laughs> Number one, you have reserved for New oh, Orleans. Okay. Oh, oh New okay. That's great. Um, and honestly, in a lot of these lists that I check online, people put New Orleans number one. It was in New Orleans food. Yeah, my buddy went. He fucking, dude, loves that shit. Yeah, no, I remember New Orleans food being good, but when I went once again, I was poor. So I sort of, mm, mm, mm. the poor travel back in the day was fun, but uh, you don't get to do all the stuff to really know. So I want, I'm looking forward to going back. Check that shit. Okay, okay, okay. okay. No, nice one. Okay. That's a good one. Right. All right, all right. Next one, next one. So, okay. Do we want to stick on the topic of food, or should we leave that for last? Leave or it then for should last. we? Let's bring okay, it back. Okay, we'll in. do that. One. Okay, let's bring it back to a different topic, okay. which uh, requires a lot of thinking. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Places to take a poop. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's get. That's okay. the only answer. Let's go. Uh, let's say. Bushes. Aeroplane. Oh, that's going to be five. That oh, can't be much yeah. worse than taking a shit on a plane. Fuck that. Uh, the, uh, he might fuck us with this one, so I might go a four still. All right, put a four. I can't four? think off the dome piece. Like, what's worse than an airplane? Shitting in a hole on the ground. Yeah, but I don't think he was going to go there. It sounds plane like it's more. Shitting on a tree still. Okay, let's see. Let's see. I'm cool with four. Right. Oh, okay. Right. Okay. In the school toilets. So oh. I remember we were going, going, uh, going it's, to school, and it was a long time for you guys. So. Oh, 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 it was a long yeah. time. Can so, I ask ooh. this question before we proceed? Okay, okay, okay. Are all of these toilet situations on physical toilets that we can sit on, and they're inside, indoors, in regular cubicles slash bathrooms slash whatever? Except one. Running? All of them except one. Okay, cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. School I'm cool toilet. with like a three for the school toilet because people can come yeah. in and sometimes they don't have like... The, sometimes they're good, sometimes they're horrible. And, yeah. yeah. Kids school toilets to me, oh. I went to I went to like four schools. Like, <clears throat> wait, let me think. I went to multiple schools. Every single time, school toilets were horror. It was mm. awful. The only time yeah. the toilets were good were university because it was a new building. And it was mm. lit. And they probably had like f- more. It was, it was beautiful. You can go to the stuff. disabled toilets. It was nice. It was sexy. Yeah. That's back on Danny. Fuck it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's the best one. That's the best one. Enough of that. Okay, run out, run out, run out. Okay. Okay, so this one I put in the wild slash a bush. Oh, that's yeah. going to be five skis. Exactly. See? See? No, you were right. Hey, I didn't disagree with you. Is he? I fucking say this. I didn't real. think he was going to go there. Face, I saved it. Okay, you saved us. You are the greatest. I appreciate you. You are the Kanye West of blind rankings. No one is better than you. <laughs> um, that was good. I'm glad you. I'm glad okay, you okay, okay. Daniel, Next one. I'm gonna Next defeat one. the Daniel. Okay, we got one and two now. We got one and two. Okay. okay. A porta potty. Oh, oh, that should like probably you're in be a four. festival. Ah. Oh, that's and the like, worst. Okay. You just approach it and it smells. You don't even want to touch the handle. Two. Let's get it to two. It's the only choice, but it should have been probably oh, yeah. Four. fourth as opposed to the I outside. I think for me, that would have been five. I think that I would rather shit outside. Oh, no. In the wa- shit in Shitting the in a wild. I think, I'd, ra- I think I'd rather though? shit in a wild. In the wild. What than are you wiping with in the wild does, fam? Like, are you actually I'll bought have a potty? My, I have like, Kleenex on me. Have to me. Paper, or you can even just... Dude, no, no, you can... Nah, the porta potty one so thin, you t- you try to wipe your ass, you put a finger on there, accidentally. Oh, and then... Now you bring your own wipes, my guy. Exactly, oh, you have to. You bring your own wipes with the moisture in it, and yeah. then you just take 
Yeah, Same in the wild. Yeah, Same in the wild. To carry your asshole. Mm. That's why I prefer the wild. You know, like, come on, bro. Okay. All right. What like, do we got for number one? Drum number roll. One, you, you have chosen. Drum roll. You have chosen. A metro station. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I don't have a boom. Here's the visual. Right. Are you ready? Oh. <laughs> okay, uh -oh. God. Okay. okay. <laughs> So Kennedy Station toilet. Oh, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, no. and Kennedy on the blow in Toronto. Like that is the worst one. That's where I picture if anyone has to take a shit on the actual train, it's there. And I nah. will kill before I take a nah. shit there. For me, when I imagine it, it's like Tinkles me, my only. worst nightmare. I wouldn't even want to know. I wouldn't even want to. My worst nightmare <laughs> is like Penn Station. You go to Penn oh, Station. Oh, that'd be extra gross. <clears throat> Mad oh homeless, right? my god it would be gross yeah american Mad ones are like well. leagues above canadian ones as grossness it's bad uh, or like it's a green you, know you know what i miss the fucking dunnies in australia that have the fucking blue lights so all the fucking smackheads smackies on their yeah. veins all the blue lights wait so what bring them back oh yeah That's we should good. they have um blue lights in the toilet yeah. so that if because your veins are blue light. so that you mm -hmm. can't Identify your vein so you can't shoot up. I see him. Wow, you can't that's pretty sick. Get him. You can't wow. fucking jab yourself, mate. Eh? Australia goes hard, man. Anyway, Australia goes hard. All the public toilets have that, and all the terrifying, all the terrifying toilet blocks have those in them. So when they have that color, uh, you know they're safe. Because Interesting. It's gonna be in there because they can't actually get their shit going. So you can go take a fucking shit or a piss. That's kind of like uh, that. respect. Actually, shit yourself because of being it's scared. Definitely better, but um. Doing poos. So, what did you rank? What were your rankings? You had number one was Metro, mm -hmm. Porta Potty, <laughs> School, two. okay, okay, Plane, in the mm -hmm. Wild. Interesting, interesting. I, know, I think for me, crazy, eh? I, like so we we have a shuffle to fix that, but that's, <clears> that's yeah, close. yeah, yeah. I think I think for me it would have been number five, Porta Potty, number four, Wild. Mm. And then, like, really? gen generally, I think number three, Metro Station. Number two. In the, in the wild, how are you going to wipe your snoots? The same so as in the porta potty. So you bring yes, wipes. You bring your own shit. I mean, right. he said that's not assu So you bring the wipes. It's not and... assuming that you're in the wild with nothing. In the mm. wild, assuming it looks like in a bush. Yeah, then you could get things crawl on you. You could fall on it. Yeah, no. Then you have to probably take your well, pants yeah, all the way it. off. Because if you're going to squat, what if it split, it, it hits the ground and then deflects onto your pants? Mm -hmm. Then you got a poo in a pants situation and you're out there in and a then wild. People walking past. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. They could see you oh, no. and then you'd be like, just That's hang crazy. in a shit, love. Sorry, keep walking. You know, yeah, it's just, exactly. um, there's many, bad. there's many problems there. But, but a number two would be aeroplane, number one would be school. As much as I hate school. The yeah. School toys. Of all of the options that you gave, school is probably the best. Particularly if it's in class, company. everyone's quiet. Oh, there's no one around. Mm, mm. Freshly after they came and just cleaned it. Yeah, let's go. Nice. Maybe nice, even nice. rub one out. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna leave this on. Oh, the yeah, yeah, true, true, true. No, no, not really. Still. Yeah, 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 yeah. You seem like the type. All right, weird <laughs> food combos. Are all right, let's go. I'm ready. Back to this one. Weird food combos. Weird food. Uh, uh, uh. All right, let's start off with. Mm. Cereal and ice cubes. Zero. So you're putting you're putting the milk in with the cereal, of course, mm -hmm. but then you put the ice cubes in it as well. Four, because he's gonna give us sure. some fucking shit. Yeah. Four. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Okay. 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 Next one. Salted popcorn with M and M's. Ah, one. Not so bad. One. Let's do. Let's do two. Because that's what? popcorn. <laughs> okay. Oh. And M&M's. Yeah. Yeah, that can't be that bad. Because you've had the thing where you like, I've seen popcorn before where you like melt chocolate and put it on top of the kernels with butter. Ooh, yeah, and then you yeah, pop yeah. the kernels in the butter and chocolate and they're already like covered in everything, mm. which is pretty, on like the stovetop. Uh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting, interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, let's go with pickles on burgers. Uh, five. Oh my God. Five. Yeah. Five, number 5,000. Okay. Oh, wait. Even, could, he, he might fuck us. Really no, nah, I don't hard. care. Nothing. I'd rather eat shit sandwiches. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. 
I would die. That's the hill Let's I would go. die on with you, my dude. I love you. <laughs> and I'm fucking fucked in pickles together. Forever. 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 Mm, wow. Fuck off, Dan. Wow. I love you, mate. Thank you. <laughs> I don't like, I don't, I'm not a big fan of pickles. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I'm not the biggest fan. I'm it's, not the biggest fan. It's not the one. I'm not yet. I'm not yet off. <laughs> All right. Next one. PB and J. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Oh, okay. That's fine, dude. This is so that's hazard. a trios, and then the oh, problem this, is yeah. he's only given us one bad one. And J, I reckon he might, he might go actual dung on bread. He might actually give us. A could just have shit on bread. <laughs> yeah, well, that's the next one. <laughs> well, well number one. Could we take it? Can we it's like a one? like a fucking semen cake. You what know what? Oh, soggy. Yeah, I know you like that. I know you like that. Don't we all? Yeah. All right, we're rolling the dice. We're rolling the dice. Right, Let's see. Number so one. number one. Wait, 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 number wait, one. wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Honestly, you've done pretty well. The number one is dessert planting. So you oh! with sugar. Yeah. With sugar, you make like a plantain pie instead of an apple pie. Or that's you make like a, yeah, 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 shit like that. I'm really happy with that. That's a that's. That, if the, if that's like a constellation, then I'm fucking here for it. I'm not mad. I wouldn't have been the number one. Number one is probably the popcorn M and M's, but uh, otherwise we mm. did not so bad. No, you didn't Honestly. do too bad. No, number one, yeah, for sure. Probably yeah, the popcorn M and M's. That sounds kind of fun. Yeah, fun. it's good. Do it in the cinema. It's good Someone was trying to tell uh, me the other day after the last. Um, oh, look, I can see that in the cinema. It's actually a good idea. Mm-hmm. Um, after the last one, that they. Uh, um, oh yeah, I was telling you off air. People were shitting on us for that on TikTok for the pineapple mm-hmm. and pizza take because i was saying it was mm-hmm. like played out but it was just a funny introduction to it obviously we knew that that take is like not exactly revolutionary and people talk about it forever it was just to set mm-hmm. it up to be like oh okay they're talking about this watch the pod um someone messaged me and he said peanut butter on burgers apparently is a thing yeah what yeah. And I, he was I like it. he I was shocked it. that i hadn't had it yeah is it good yeah it's, it's pretty it's pretty good yeah i've i'm not gonna be like oh. getting it all the time but like I've had it, it and it was fine. It was pretty good. It was. Right. It was honestly. I'm not. I'm not mad. No, Dan. Hmm. Which one though? Like smooth or crunchy peanut butter? Oh, I think it was smooth. I think it was smooth. Fuck, yuck ass, dude. Like, and so, yeah, like on I'm the bun or? It's like um, instead of putting like uh, you know the ketchup or mayonnaise on the bun, you'd put uh, like a big spread Fuck, of peanut butter. Of is it yeah, subtle yeah. or is it like? Like this well, is... peanut butter in general is very subtle. Uh, you think like the taste of peanut butter is very subtle. I think yeah, with, it doesn't with, taste so much with meat. So it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I oh. I would try. I wouldn't I wouldn't knock it. Mm, peanut butter right. is very versatile. I would very try versatile. it, but I'm not like you said. Yeah, I'd try it, but I would also be like, mm. it's definitely not something to die for. You know, it's not like yeah. I think it's amazing. So, probably trash though actually that is a hill i would probably die on is i think peanut butter i don't think it's shit but i think it's so overrated, overrated. and everyone in north america actually we're kind of it's maybe obsessed, right? obsessed i might be preaching to like the choir here with the three of us not from here but like in australia yeah. and i imagine in england there was no peanut butter chocolate like reese's is not a thing in australia oh no that that was a thing in england it we was that. okay yeah, so we had that Maybe that it is fair that you. I don't know. It wasn't a thing. I definitely peanut butter sandwiches, peanut butter and jelly. Like no, definitely not. That's not a thing. PB and J in England, not a thing either. That's not a thing. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Cool. It seems like, like here stuff. it's movie stuff. Yeah, that's why we know yeah. it too. It just felt like everything. Movies. Yeah. It's really good though. It is really good. I'm not gonna lie. No, uh, PB and yeah, J is, is good. Good combo. Good. Solid. Solid. Mm. Just not like mm. popular. I just popular. don't do it. Why With is Vegemite it in everything? And cheese, Vegemite, and butter. Like that's it. My my uh, my friend was telling me the other day he was eating peanut butter and cheese. What do you hmm. think? Peanut butter and cheese. I'm sure it's probably all, the saltiness. All of my it. friends were losing mm. their mind, saying, "What the fuck are you, you doing?" But I was kind of like, decent, "What kind of cheese?" I'm assuming yeah. cheddar. Hmm. But I reckon it would be fine. I, like I actually brie. just don't think it'd be bad. Yeah, I think it'd be terrible. I'm not like in my, like it's not like immediately you're just like Ugh, like and it, yeah like kind yeah. of. If you think about what what you said, no, should like it, it replaces the mayo on a burger with that creaminess of it. Pause. So then, if you had cheese <laughs> with it, it's kind of replicating that ish vibe. And I reckon if you had like a soft cheese, like a brie, probably be pretty cool. Oh, that would probably be pretty. You know what I mean, I try that. You know, yeah, I try it because you know how you get like the fuck of those fancy jams that are like sweet chili That's jam. That's literally what I was gonna say. They have all those different jams, and they even have the savory stuff you'd also spread on soy cracker. Yeah, and it's like, like it's, pretty, it's pretty, pretty <clears> good. 
Yeah, I'd give that a try. Um, yeah. Nice. Also, Good one, Dan. Just like to say, yeah, I had the Vegemite with you. Do you remember? Yes. And it actually wasn't too bad. So that would have been a hill I would have died on last Previously. Year. But you had it Last correctly year. now, though. And, you and I had it and... Like, thinly really spread. Yeah. I don't know why people are losing their minds over it, but, like... It's, it's hard fine. if you didn't grow up with it. I think there's, like, associations with it. Like, to me, mm. it's like, yeah. oh, if it's something where it's like, oh, you only need a little bit for it to be good, then I'm like, it can't be that good, because if you wanted it to have... If you, if you liked it that much, you'd have a lot of it. So. But it's, it's, it's fine. It's just a strong flavor. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. Yeast extract. Kind of yeah, gross. that's it. But like, it's it's, it's a weird. It is fucking weird. Like, we're I think we can all admit oh, it. shit sure. is weird as fuck. But it's for an sure. acquired taste, and once you get that shit, it's uh with the cracker it's fun. combo that mm-hmm. I had. Honestly, so I'd have I'd actually have that just like at home. I'd have that. I yeah, would. you do need to have that a bit a... of butter on a on a cracker. Yeah, 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 put yeah, yeah. The Vegemite on. It's definitely better on a to- on like hot toast, so it melts it. Yeah. As fun. opposed to because it can get if you do have little clumps, the clumps get you, and they they're like spicy. Like it's, it's like, can't be that good. It can't be that good then. Sure. Well, it's just going to be used correctly. It's probably the same as like anchovies or something. Like you don't want to put like piles of them Ooh. bitches, but if you have just the right amount, that's fucking money. I do, like, I hot do sauce. like anchovies. Anchovies um, mm-hmm. is mm-hmm. the best mm-hmm. topping for pizza, by the way. I hope you know that. I fuck with anchovies. Anchovies are the best on pizza. I fuck best with topping, it. best topping for pizza, anchovies. So okay. good. Get the fuck out of my face, bro. You're, you're childish. <laughs> All, right. <laughs> All right. Let's go to pizza toppings. Pizza. Oh, do you, okay, so we want to do that and don't worry so much about the news. We can do the pizza topping one. Oh, we can address the the beef. We don't have we don't have to do any of this stuff. We can do whatever the fuck we want. Like we yeah, can let's do, that. Let's, let's do the pizza, pizza toppings. Pizza All right, let's let's do pizza. pizza. Since we're talking about pizza, let me go back to the screen share right here. All right, yes. y'all. So this is pizza topping tier list for humans. Okay, for humans. Oh, fuck. Okay, yeah, fuck that. So it's yeah. sort of a little harder to see. So we have. Let's hmm. start. Oh, anchovies is the first one here. Anchovies is S. There's nothing. That, there's just nothing better. Yeah. There's genuinely nothing better. Yeah. You really think F? F. Okay. That's so childish, bro. That's so childish. Uh, what do you put, <laughs> you put so number childish. one pepperoni. You put number one child. pepperoni. You're literally a child. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, <laughs> if Dan's saying S, Notion's saying F. What's if and I? Okay, so I'm the decider here. I've never, I, I've actually never had them on a pizza, so I actually put have to put them in never had, so I couldn't be part of. The so you, then your vote can't uh, count. Then so therefore, I I would probably do more. Maybe, uh, maybe I'd be cool with a. Have I? Maybe. It's just salty fish, bro. It's really not a big deal. I feel like anchovies are like. Um, I've had them. Okay, so we'll put a then just just to balance it out because I haven't had it in a while and I might change my mind. Um, bacon. I mean, bacon's got to be yes, no. Yes. I wouldn't say S. Oh, wow. Like, yep. S. If anchovies is A, bacon's S, shut your mouth. <laughs> Let's go. This is the man that, this type of yeah, guy, like you, that he's, he's Pizza Hut. I ain't gonna make pizza. You know what I mean? This is, <laughs> fellow, have your bacon at Pizza Hut. It's fine. I'm fine with that. I don't eat Pizza Hut. It's trash. I eat fucking good shit. Uh, bacon to me, it's, it, I know it's, it's good, but I'm not gonna be like, oh, I need it on my pizza, you know? Okay. Need it on my pizza. But it's a great fucking. It's one of the best toppings, which is what we're talking about. It would be B to me. And notion, you say S, and I also say yes. So then that would be S- it. bacon. That's okay. Um, what about banana peppers? Probably like. Mm. I mean, they could, they could go on for sure. For me, yeah. it's S. This they, S for they, me for sure. S. I, I S. I want banana peppers on pizza at all times. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes. You don't have like, been bro. Real spit. C will be impressed with me. I don't know, Dan, if you give a fuck, but I've been buying them things like the hot uh, pepper rings. And it's like, you know, a, a pickle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get the tongs and I put them on and I grill them on the fuckers oh, and I put them on all nice. my shit. Fuck Dude, yeah. Love that so, shit. Let's so, go. Put them as high as you want, dude. Because uh, okay. they're, they're in that. I have the, the orange, the the banana and the red joint. The, that, that's the optimal. Those three in a mix thing, dude. That's what I'm fucking smashing oh, on burgers and breakfast things. I'm so then, I love that. So you go and me ahead. are aligned. Yeah, go. Dan, where where it, would you? What's your thoughts? Dan. I have no issues with it. I just don't think it's... get an A. They get an S. It could be A if it's fair. Like you I could put compare, it. You can't compare the two. Andrew the one so one's elite. Long, one is like, oh yeah, I guess. Like if if it I'm came on so... it, I'm not gonna take it off. 
So I'm not going to be like, can you please add that? You know okay. What I mean? So what, what would you put it as? Fair enough. Fair enough. It's, fair like, enough. it's, like, it's like a B. Okay. It's so then it's, it's, do we do, and me and Noshi, and I'm saying S and Noshi are saying A or something? Let's just put it A. So I'm saying S too, but like we can put A just to keep with the fucking choves. Perfect. Okay. How about olives? Black olives. Honestly, That's- love them. Never, never not mad at them anymore. Once I, I reached like 20 fucking eight or nine and I was like, you know what? I can do this. And I've been loving them ever since. So yeah, I'm <laughs> fucking down with black olives. Dude, I used to fucking hate them so bad. <laughs> give, us a, give us a letter. Uh, fucking, they might even go at A as well. Dan? Uh, they're, they're not intrusive. Uh, it's, they're it's delicious. They're just salty. Yeah, that's the thing. They're not intrusive. Bad with them. There's not like that. That is true. That is true. But I'm kind of thinking it on a sense of like, oh, when I read a menu, it's like, oh, this has black olives. I'm like, You're I'm like, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm like, oh, okay, it has black olives. Same like, way about yeah. anchovies. So it should go like an A or a B. No, but like, if it's anchovies, I'm creaming over that. Yeah, but I guess it's two to one. Is that that's why anchovies well, are up there? Okay, cool. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Um, well. Um, I'm also comparing it to other stuff that I'm seeing here, mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. I wouldn't put it above a lot of these other things. But I also don't dislike it, so it's probably like a B. Do a B. Can we do a B, guys? I, can do a... I would do S personally. Um, really? Olives would... are the greatest. I love them too. I love them too. Uh, I'd probably do an A if I was going to be. Frank. Okay, then A. If you want to do, okay. And then we can shuffle because what Dan said is fair. That if we put other things up, and then we can be like, oh, but I like we like them more. Then we can move it around. Um, okay, how about uh, pepperoni? Oh, hang on, what's, what's this going to be? A S no, there's a, two different it? ones here. Can you see? Let me Where's see. the yeah. other one? See the oh, one? One's salami, two. one's pepperoni. So, which is the top one? Top one's pepperoni. I'd assume the top one's pepperoni. yeah, because it looks salami. smaller. I don't know. Oh, mm. if it's if it, okay, yeah, and there's like it's large salami. dongs next to it. I would say maybe that is salami then. Okay, uh, maybe this one's pepperoni, the one that's just the slices. S or A, both of them are S or A. Like, I don't care. Whatever what happens... Do you, is let's just right. put them both in the same thing. Which one do you care? I would say I mean, S tier is pretty yeah, pretty yeah. fire. They're yeah. fundamental to a pizza, so they have to be S. Dan? Bacon's not uh, fundamental, but we love it so much. That's why that luckily got an S. So those, are you saying think, we love bacon? We just love bacon. Is that what it is? We just love no, bacon it. on pizza is the shit, bro. It's amazing. But And then it's, those other two are also fundamental to it, uh, separate from the fact that we love it so much. <clears> I think... <throat> to be s as well because it is fundamental it's like cornerstone to a pizza especially Damn. in north america I, I like it i like it i'm just like it's basic it's basic that's what it is to me it's like okay. I, if i ever go out and get pizza because i've had pepperoni so and many times I'm, so I'm gonna basic. i'm gonna try and avoid it because of how basic it is but obviously yes okay legacy, we can put what, it in a what leg- about a legacy yeah legacy a for sure Okay. But, Legacy A. But okay. it's basic. Well, that makes sense. I mean, you kind of, you kind of, that, that you, makes sense. Are you guys ready for something? Are you ready? Go on. Okay. Go on. Pineapple? Oh, yeah. Uh, Let's go up there. Let's I wouldn't go. Say, I wouldn't say F. I wouldn't, I'd say it's not the worst thing in the world. It's really not that bad. I, I'm going to keep clapping as you talk. <laughs> F, F, that, F. That, that doesn't sound like a clapping. Um, Let's put it in. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, everyone. What are your uh, votes? Yeah. My vote is F, obviously. Oh my god, dude! Pineapple's Me? delicious on the pizza. It's not non-essential, but when it's on there, it's a great time. So, if for being for not being a cunt, I'm gonna say B. Jesus, I I'd say it. I think it's great. <laughs> the Hawaiian slash. There's a couple other versions that have Hawaiian on it. They're, they're, they're just Jesus. really nice, dude. Like, it's, a, it's a good time. It's a good mix. It's a good blend of flavors. If you don't like pineapple on a pizza, you're a bit of a puff. So I, I don't know. You CP guys should argue over pineapple. it because I am impartial to a pineapple on a pizza. I don't, so where I don't would you put it, it though? So would you put, chuck it in a C or a B? I'd be like a D or something. Or an a? Like a D. Cool. Yeah, A's cool. Or an right. A. So I'll, I'll, I'll go. Uh, I'll go like a B. You guys need to argue because you, know, you guys are opposite end F. of the spectrum. We can put it in like a B or a C if you want, mate. It's all right. It's it. Okay, so I'll put it in F. Sweet. All right. Do we want to do? Um, <laughs> what about what about eggplants? What okay. About I'll put boat, it C. Oh. I know. I'm joking. I'll put it. Has C. C. Okay. Sure. 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 I guess it's like fuck. I am like giving. I am giving here. I am like leeway. That is my like olive branch. 
<laughs> pun intended. <laughs> what about eggplant? Enough. You know, you know what? No, I, eggplant is lit. Oh eggplant my god! Is so nice. You guys are fucked. I, 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 I'd say no. Listen, I'd eat eggplant it. Is lit. But I wouldn't put it any higher than like an F. It's still good. I wouldn't be like, oh fuck, give me an I eggplant. Can't, eggplant. I can't be happy. I can't be happy with pineapple being above eggplant. If if it was, oh, I'm happy with them being dude, same level. Can't be the same plane. They're not even close, dude. Okay, how's this? What 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 if it's this? That's a, I, no. I, 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 that's fine. That's fine. No, because pineapple's more way fun. better than eggplant, dude. Old fucking cunts up for that one. I don't, I don't know. It's nah, like... when I was on a C at least, I'm not even kidding, mate. Okay, hold up. So give okay. me your letter for eggplant, because then we just have to go to a straight strategic vote. Oh, I mean, no I sh- like it. I mean, just shit, don't, don't give me an explanation. Give me a letter. Fuck. For eggplant? Yes. <laughs> I mean... Um, that's the only way to do it. A, a D, D or a C. D or a C. Pick one. Please. Fuck. D. Dan. D. D it is. I would say F, but you guys outrank me. Pineapple. Letter. Brad. Probably a C, Notion. C, a C, or a B. Dan. Like a, probably a B, actually. Probably a B. Dan. D. F. You say which F. means it'll probably stay in D, D if you kind of average that out. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um... I've been picking all of these ingredients. I just want to do ones I really hated. For actually, let me do one more I hate, and then we'll go. Oh, there's two more I hate. Mushrooms. F. F. Dan. Oh, too late. Two Fs. Wait. Oh. <laughs> yeah, boy. What would you put? Uh, called it my screen. Um, mushrooms. Mm. Get that in A, man. What are you talking about? Oh my god. Childish man. Face dance. <laughs> oh, sorry. Majority rules. Blah blah blah. How, Good story. How are you Catch picky? Next. Okay. Blah, um, blah, blah. Let me put one more. I hate zucchini. F. F. I oh, on a pizza. No man. No, what it the should fuck? be in the never no. had pile. It should be on pizza, dude. Facts. Who's put zucchini on fucking zucchini pizza? on pizza? Oh, in the never I had had really good pizza in Montreal. Put it in the never had on one oh. still. If easy, click it down. I'm not even doing that. Never no, had. Fake. I've never I had on a pizza because I don't eat it. Yeah. Fuck it off. Sorry, Dan. Love you. Bye. Oh, my. You guys are All right. You know what, Dan? Because you're getting... Your, your Ninja Turtle pizzas, man. You're getting yeah. your <laughs> Ninja Turtle pizza. Dan, do you want to... You choose. I'm rinsing you because okay. I'll just... I'll, I'll choose. I'll choose. Wait. What is the, the left next to the blue cheese? Uh, This is, looks like chicken. Oh, oh okay. Nice. Okay. All right. Chicken so, like, pizza. there's basil, chicken, blue cheese. Oh, this is chicken wings. Oh, okay. Chicken I'm not sure wait, what wait, it what's is. Below the, what's below the alleged chicken? This? Yeah. Pull Could pull. be yeah. shrimp. Hard to tell. Shrimpies? Hard to tell. Oh, I'm going to do my zoom. Um, okay. Next to that is oysters. There's uh, bell peppers, cauliflower, red onion, sausage, tom- cherry tomatoes, corn, regular tomatoes, turkey, okay. cheese, garlic, pesto, green olives, ham. Uh, green peppers for jalapenos, meatballs, white onions. Wait, what's the thing mm-hmm. next to the sweet corn on the right and above turkey? Is cheese, uh, some sort of a, some I... sort of crumbly cheese. Crumbly cheese. Okay, you know what? Truth. Let's put the basil in F. I mean, sorry, in S. Sorry, what am I saying? F. Sorry, that's childish. S. S. Basil is in S. Basil is so key. No one well, needs to be on a pizza. No, love it, love it, love it. Beauty. Love it. Oh wow, look at us agree. That's fun. Look at that, and, guys. Uh, Good job, guys. Well done. Let's uh, let's put cherry tomatoes in A because they are very. Excuse very me, nice, what the nice. fuck? Oh, Legit? Notion A's tomatoes. Zero. Okay, uh, I would. Is, picky F. is man. I don't Legit like F. cherry tomatoes no, on I'm pizza. Not, so not if I say C, then it's like A C F. So maybe that's in the middle. It's allergic F. Okay. Wow. Then we just got to average um, it out. If, if if two people agree, that trumps everyone. If all three of us disagree, it's like an average of the three. That's the only way to do this. Can I okay. put um, can I put pesto in A? Pesto, pesto. pizzas. Ooh. Pesto pizza is pretty good. I, I, I don't know if I put A. No, I wouldn't put A. I go B. B or a, a. Probably a B or a C actually. B's cool. I'm cool with B. Man, uh, eating Ninja Turtle pizzas, man. Mm, okay. No, 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 Ninja Turtle pizzas. There's better ones. Right. 
probably C. C next to tomatoes, but fucking no worries, mate. Pesto C. Shit, man. Shit. Yeah, I could do that. I could do with that. Because we've got basil at the top, and pesto is just basil and nuts and oil. And what, that's that's amazing. <sighs> I prefer tomato. Fine, we'll put it in B. All right. Yeah, um, Fine. What about jalapenos? Oh, dude. <laughs> fucking A or S. They're amazing. Uh, the thing yes. is, yeah, a lot of them. Yes. I, 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 I like jalapenos, yes. but, but a lot of the time when you have it with pizza, on it's pizza, pickled. it's like fucking amazing. It's, Yo, it's dude, usually pickled. That's why pepperoni should be an S. It's a, it's a so, fine, it's a you know what? What about putting it next to the banana peppers being it's in A? Fuck, it's S, dude. So that, Pepper, so that, everything yeah. else is in, like. But you need to. Like, but like, are you a, talking. Yes, then. Are, are you talking. Are you talking like. Like regular jalapenos, or you talk about pickled? Because the only time I've ever had it on pizza is pickled. Because regular jalapenos are nice, and I'd put that yeah, a a is good with me. But like a pickled thing, that kind of ruins the profile. I agree with that. Pizza. It ruins. So the let's assume Stronger. they're raw dog. No, that means they're vinegary. They're vinegary as hell. Hey, raw dogs. If okay. it's raw dog, then yeah, I put a. I put a okay. for sure. Mm. Sweet. Mm. Um, let's do a because we're at an hour thirty now, so we're kind of like tapped out. But is there let's anything? A couple that I've never had. Uh, blue cheese, never had, but I think I would. But like, I'd be down to try. Uh, is that uh, mus? Is it mussels? Is like... is? I can't see from my. Oh, uh, this is oysters. Oysters is oysters. weird. I never had oysters. Never on had pizza. Oysters. pizza. I love oysters though. Meatballs, s. Oh come on, man! What's this Ninja Turtle shit? Why are you, why are you getting a? fucking? What? No! Well, who's having meatball pizza? I who's having pizza? It's great. Who? No, it's like you mashed it up. You know, like you know. No, when was the last time anyone had meatball pizza that wasn't from? Dominic? Have you heard of oh. Italy? That's a good point. <laughs> but yeah, also, so you went to Italy. Yeah, you went to Italy, Italy last last week, right? Or was it last year? The year before? Twenty years ago, and what of it? Okay, well then. Is well this then. shrimp? This is meatball. shrimp. Okay. Meatball should be that meatball pizza to me. Yeah. That's a sign oh, of a shit pizza. Different. So <laughs> you can you can cook it down, <laughs> whatever. But there's well, mad that, other good ones in here. There is so. no such thing as a meatball pizza that comes from like a nice gourmet restaurant. That's fine. Right, let's put C. Let's put C. Jesus. Fine. Okay. Fine. Wow. Meatballs next to tomatoes. I'm gonna kill you. You can't. Okay. What about shrimp? You know, hey. I, I I haven't had it a lot, but I I, I do like it. S. I wouldn't say, uh, S, I don't know, but like A for sure. I love shrimp. I love shrimp, but like Shrimp's the best. A for sure. Shrimp okay. are the best proteins ever. Fuck off. Okay. Yes. What about. So are these chicken wings like not like sides because. I don't know. I don't like, know. like let's just be... consider them. I don't know what this, don't, the no, far don't left. Count. Never don't had count. Chicken wings on a pizza. So never had. No. Cauliflower. Yeah, never like, had. Never Corn. Had. Never had. You never had oh, corn on a pizza? No, who the fuck puts olives? corn on a pizza? Green olives like, I... on pizza? No thanks. Fuck that right off. Garlic on pizza? Yes, please. All the time. Drop it on there. Whatever. But usually the, the, the garlic's just in the marinara, so let's calm. Yeah. Well, if you put garlic next to the pesto, because it's usually yeah, yeah. garlic yeah, that, in the I pesto. Yeah, I think that's fair. I think that's fair. But right. then I'd put... I've had sweet corn. I wouldn't say it's anything else. I would never put it above mushrooms. Mushrooms is amazing on pizza. I got um, onions. Hey, let's go onions. Talk about onions. F. Yeah. <laughs> it fucking sucked my dick onions. Un- Fuck <laughs> you, onions. <laughs> They're fine yes. on pizza. They're fine. I don't know. I don't care about that. Fucked, mate. I say to God, everything else, cool. Burgers and shit. Big tomatoes. And that. You know, yeah, give me that tomatoes, flavor. But... I love it. Love it. I'll what about it crumbly later. cheese? What, 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 what cheese is that? Is that what? Are we talking feta or... Is that goat no, cheese? What is that? It looks like parmesan to me. S or A. Oh, if it's if it's parmesan, yeah, put it in A. Oh, yeah. Put it in A. Um, sausage. You know what? Yeah, You're mm. a good sausage oh, on a pizza. It's great. That could, be, that could be an A. As in, like, I'm talking about like a, a nice sausage on pizza. Yeah, yeah. Well. Like they're all like cut no... little slices. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Not no Ninja Turtle shit, man. Talk about sausage. Shh, relax. Ninja, ninja Turtle man. shit. Um, ninja. turkey. I never had turkey on a pizza. Turkey in general, just mm. meh. That could be a yeah. B. Has everyone had turkey on a pizza? Uh, nah, uh, I know. There you go. Yeah, so we're never had. What about I'll... bell peppers? I don't like bell peppers on the pizza. I would put them in F. I'm not uh, mad at them. I'd but... happily have it in D or below. I don't really care for okay, it. Let's put... yeah. let's go D. 
What about sliced ham or just ham in general? Oh, ham is oh, a or a. Ham is a for sure. Oh really? Are we putting We're it, the oh, Aussie but, stuff? But are we putting it? In the same league as everything else in there, because we're talking yep. like we're, we're talking big big ballers in that league. You know? they're, they're, there's <laughs> anchovies, there's sausage, yep. Yep. there's there's yep. there's the raw dog jalapenos. Yeah. There's the yeah, yeah, I guess they managed to get there. Okay, um, I, I don't know what the rest of these things are. I think the other rest of them are kind of pointless. What, where, what is that? The the far right. I team? actually don't know. It looks it looks like long, like it looks like, like the, shrimp tails on a like pizza. Is what it looks wrong. like. Oh, ne- never had. Like pasta on pizza. I don't know what it is, man. Let's put it um, there and then chicken wings. The wings never had, but then what's the other chicken? Yeah. Chicken drumsticks. <sighs> chicken Maybe. Drumsticks? Done. Game completed. I guess never had. This is the first time uh, we've got this far. Well, if it's just chi- let's just call it chicken. Chicken on a pizza is probably B. Oof. Uh, little... I don't know, man. Love too it. high? Love I can that. put it down. It's too high. It's just no, 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 The tomatoes suck. Honestly, no. Has to go above. <laughs> no, you can't say that. Yeah. You can't do that. Nah, nah, nah. Because there's a lot of things here that I just do not understand. Oh, yeah. None big. of us agree with this. This is, like, I think eating is where it becomes too difficult to, like... Yeah, when there's picky eaters, yeah. Again. Yeah, I'm picky. I'm picky, okay? I'm selective. Yeah. You man and your Ninja Turtle pizzas. I can't have that. Ninja this Turtle, is, this, this is This is domino shit. Yeah, Bacon on a pizza. Wow. You guys said it at the same time. You can, when you go Domino's, this is what you guys order. This, <laughs> you're not going to nice. You're not going. I'll show you good pizza places. And message me after. I'll show you good. Pizza <laughs> Shut up. You're all right, look. Right we at an hour thirty-five, so we didn't do any of these stuff. We'll do all of the the tea, all the Sorry. themes next week. Um, not not that much happened. It's like you know, Nikki and Meg Stallion are beefing. Amazon and Benzino were beefing. Super Bowl was announced. Benny the Butcher's album was great. Twenty One Savage Ooh, biopic was speaking of the oh, wow. Benny album. Quickly, did you hear the song with um, um, Amani Caesar? Yes, she's so sick. Yeah, she's great, huh? She's so sick. Oh my god, she's amazing. So we can talk about so that sick, guys. in a bit more uh, depth next week. Um, but yeah, I think we're uh, we're pretty good much job, all good, man. boys. Episode one fifty one. You know what I'm job. saying? Um, I mean. Then, hang on. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, well, if that's it, uh, Daniel, where can everyone find you online, you big cockhead? Cockhead. Um, uh, HCFGXMING on Gang. Instagram, Twitch, YouTube. I'm, you know what's crazy? I'm drastically losing Instagram followers. I just think Instagram hate my account, so I'm done. I just, I just, I don't even know. I don't even know if I'm going to upload it. It's just, just ridiculous. So. Follow you on Twitch then. Yeah, Twitch and YouTube. That's Twitch the main has. thing. So. so, yeah. Yeah, that's me. Notion. Mate, at Notion Baby on Instagram, Twitter, and fucking, I don't know, what else? Uh, I don't know, Facebook, TikTok? Facebook, I guess, whatever, get, get your dog up your mum. Uh, at Notion MTB on uh, Instagram and YouTube, <clears throat> fucking man's got fucking shit going on right now. Um, I don't know, NotionBeast.com, say good day, get a dog through you. See, Fizzy? Nice. Fuck yeah, let's take a quick fummy. We've uh, we don't need to take one because I'm gonna make one after, so it's fine. Oh yeah, you are. So we don't even need it no more. Oh yeah, we're making new thumbnails. Ooh. Fuck, new... I forgot. This is awesome. Yeah, big ups down like on the new thumbnails. thumbnails. Give us the comment. Thank you. Tell you what you fucking Thank reckon. You. Yeah. Oh yeah, I totally forgot. We got a whole new process. This is so much better. Um, find me at CWFOR everywhere for the most part, guys. Thank you for watching and listening. If you enjoyed the flipping episode, smash them fummies, hit them subbies, and hit that notification bell. You bitch. Ding dong. So you know when the new drops. Follow us everywhere at the Moving Fam at Bad Habits Pod on Insta Grizzly, mate. Delivering every week. We'll see y'all in the next one. Get a frog up, yo. Ribbit. Ooh, like Good that. to your mom. Like Cunt. Yeah. Nice. Ah. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh. Yeah. Yo. A C word. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Pineapple on pizza sucks fat dicks. Bye. You-